how long you been making music, bro? I've been doing this shit for a minute, bro. For real, for real. I was, you know, I was one of them young dudes, like, beating on the table at the, you know what I'm saying, at the school, you feel me? Okay. If it's a new nigga that move in, yeah, I got I got, I got pressing. We got to see what that's about. All right, off top. Where you go to school at? Uh, I went to Snow, bro, over on the west side. All right, now, being that you went to that school, you ever battle anybody at school? Uh, yeah, hell, hella niggas, but is there anybody that people know? That's, that's like cracking right now, type yeah. time. I mean, I rap with a lot of niggas. Like, you feel me? Like, I, uh, I was, I was, I was one of always first orders. That's my big bro. And shit, you feel okay. me? Shout out to the nigga. You feel me? But you know, back then it was that was bar for bar time. And on my soul, bro, on that, on, on my side of town, bro, it was nobody fucking with. Fucking with me on lyrics, other than like the old head niggas dot and done, like period. It was me and Slink. It was dot and done, period. So I definitely been in the school with niggas and went toe for toe with niggas. Niggas, niggas can vouch. Okay, okay, okay. So uh, yeah, you know I mean, like you got any any you got any content that's out there that people can find? Uh, right now, bro, I really, I really don't. I, I've been slacking on my map. You feel me? Uh, I got a little couple little features and shit. I got the joint that I just did with knees. You know what I'm saying? I got a joint, an old dip that's out with Pound called Maxwell. Uh, I got a joint with my man's Homicide, Mac from Homewood. You know what I'm saying? And I got old shit from them. But right now, I'm, I'm just working on getting me back to where I need to be. I'm Boy. saying, like, can people find them songs? Yeah, yeah, no doubt. They okay. on YouTube, man. You know okay. what I mean? You look up Western Hazy or. Look up the people that I named and you'll, you know, scroll and you'll find them jamming. Alright, so what gives you motivation to make music? I got kids, bro. You know what I mean? I love my kids. Period. And it's like, you know, what 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 other options we got out here? You know what I'm saying? I ain't saying it like that, but you know, as a man, you can make decisions for yourself, but at the same time, if the opportunity ain't presented, what the fuck you gonna do? So yeah. You know, I had to just come to a, a, a realization of like, what, how the fuck is I'm gonna really get some bread, like the money I'm gonna be satisfied with, you feel me? And this is it. Okay, okay, so like, what's your ultimate goal when it comes to the music? I'm trying to be like, I would love to be like an A&R or something, man, because I feel like I got a good, I feel like I got a good ear for this shit, you know what I'm saying? Like, okay. I feel like I know what, 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 what people, what people want, you know what I'm saying? Cause contrary to, you know what I'm saying, popular belief, nigga, it's more niggas living like us than living like them. You know what I'm saying? But we follow that, we follow that bullshit. 36 inch rims and Maybachs and all this shit. Bro, everybody ain't living like that. It's more niggas living in shit like this. You feel me? So. So you saying that we are not minorities? Nah, we not, bro. We the majority, bro. We just, some, somebody flipped it. You know what I'm saying? Cause it, I'd have been places, bro, and it's, it's, it's more motherfuckers that can relate to me than, let's say, a Rick Ross or a Jay-Z. How many motherfucking millionaires you know, let alone billionaires, bro? You know a lot of thousandaires, though. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? So... Small TV, one, two, three, four. Get shot, dog.